All right, guys. Wanted to show you the newest addition to my uh, Banshee controller lineup. This is a turbocharger from an L5P Duramax it's from 2017 and newer. So real quick, the difference between this type of turbo and then the whole set VGTs. This is an HE 200 VG, and this is a new HE 300 VG. They operate the same. You have a unison ring. It protrudes out over the turbine, channels all the exhaust gas, speeds it up. The smaller one does the same thing, even though it looks a little different. What's unique about the v VNTs that you find on uh, Fords and Power Strokes and uh, the Duramaxes is the veins. So these veins actually pivot like this instead of having a unison ring come out. So in my opinion, these are actually better if you just want to spool as fast as you can, maybe put on a gas engine, um, or even as a high pressure for a diesel, and then you know use a low pressure, like I would say bigger than a 300, maybe four or 500 series as your low pressure for a whole set VGT, because that still gives you that really nice exhaust brake. Um, I know a couple companies out there that do offer exhaust brakes for the VNT and VVT turbos. The problem is when these things rotate, the exhaust gas can only go one direction, and that's through the turbine. Whereas when you look at the whole set VGTs, the wall protrudes out and it's actually going to deflect the gas around the turbine and it'll actually start to stall it. So real quick. So all this is doing is it's rotating, so it's coming back, so it's wide open right now, and then it's going to start getting tighter and tighter and tighter until it's fully tight, and then it's going to rotate back. So right now, the program is just sweeping it back and forth. Cool. Thanks for watching. Like I said, if you guys are interested in running one of these on pretty much any engine you want, my Banshee VGT controllers, which is right here, you can control it. These are IP67, the reverse polarity protected, surge protected up to 60 volts. They run on 12 and 24 volts, and you can control any of the turbos I can control. So you won't get one controller just for one turbo. You can easily change out the harness, well, the adapter to the harness because they're modular to whatever turbo you decide to use. And depending on how you set it up, you can potentially control two turbos. Like in this application, you can have this as your high pressure and the whole set as your low pressure or vice versa. Thanks.